Hey, what's up guys? Coach Bobby, I'm back here guys to talk about the magic. The magic that is in the dirt, right? So you guys see me, I'm here. This is my temple. This is where I get my work done to build the physique that I have, to build the confidence that I have, to build the drive, the passion, the persistence, the ability to fight, the ability to per persist, the ability to come back from pain, the ability to fight through adversity, the ability to see what I want and then go get it. Right, that happens here. That happens here in my metaphorical temple. But this temple can be anything. Right? This temple can be a classroom. The temple can be your dining room. The temple can be the library. The temple can be a stage on which you practice your speaking. The temple can be whatever classroom, whatever gym, whatever arena you need to be in to get better, to chase your dream, your vision. Right? But here's the trick, guys. Here's the secret. The secret, the magic is not in the weights. The secret, the magic is not in the books. The secret, the magic is not in the workshops or the coaches or the trainers. The secret, the magic is in the dirt. Now I've said this to many of my student athletes that I train. I've said this to many of the teams that I work with. Right? I got to where I was as an athlete. I got to where I was in football because I understood at a very early age that the magic is in the dirt. The magic is in the grind. The magic is in what you do. And, and what happens is, the beauty of it is, is the muse, right? The religion, the spirit that is your dream. And that's how I see it. I see your dream, your vision, like a religion, like a spirit, like a goddess. Like a muse that is watching over you and has, and has the authority to give you what you want. The authority to give you what you dream of. And so that goddess, that God, that muse, that angel, if you will, that religion is watching you to see if you are doing what you need to do to be great. If you're doing what you need to do to accomplish the goals that you tell me you want, the dreams and visions that you tell me you want. That God is watching you. That muse is watching you to see if you understand the magic is in the dirt, right? And all you have to do is push and grind and understand that when you're in the classroom, right, when you're on the field, when you're on the stage and practicing your craft, all you have to do is honor the goddess, honor the muse, honor the God, honor the religion that is your dream, honor the religion that is your goal, honor the religion that is your vision. You have to honor it. And the muse or the goddess or the God, it knows whether or not you commit it. It's like praying to your to your God or your or your religion. They know your God knows whether or not you are telling him or her the truth. The God that you worship knows whether or not you've given all you have of your spirit, of your soul, to what you said you want to be. If you were faithful to your dream, if you were faithful to your vision, your muse, your God, your God is. It knows. And so what it will ask you, what your dream, your vision will ask you is very simple. When you show up and ask for what you want in life and ask for the dream or vision that you want, your muse and your goddess and your God and your religion of your dream will only ask you one thing. Show me your hands. Show me your hands. Show me that you did the work. Show me that you did the grind. Show me that you gave me the effort. Show me that you were faithful to me. That you were committed to me. And when you show your fingers, it will show what you did. When you show your fingers, it will show if you were committed. When you show your finger, it will show if you understood that the magic is in the dirt. 
The magic is not in the tool. The magic is in the dirt. And so when you, when you want to be great and you're in your temple, right? The gym, the classroom, right? The desk, the stage, the dining room. When you're in your temple, all you have to do is honor it and commit to it and be faithful to it and put your hands in the dirt and grind and show the goddess of your dream. Show the goddess of your vision. Show the religion that is your goal. That I'm doing what I said I would do. I'm doing what I committed to do. I'm doing what I told you I would do. I'm faithful to my dream. I'm faithful to my vision. I understand that the magic is not in the tools. The magic is not in the workshops. The magic is not in the coaches. The magic is in what I do with it. The magic is in the dirt. And so all you have to do, guys, is remember that. Remember to grind. Remember to push. Remember to study. Remember to train. Remember to work on what is your vision. Because one day, one day that vision, that goal, that dream will come to you. And it will ask you one thing, one thing to, to prove to it, to prove to your dream, to prove to your vision that you are committed, that you are faithful. It will ask you one thing, show me your hands, show me your hands, and then you can prove to your vision. You can prove to your goals. You can prove to your dreams that look, my hands are dirty. My fingers are dirty because I understood I understood and I understand that the magic is not in the tools or the weights or the diet or the classroom or the books or the workshops. I understand and I understand now, I will always understand that the magic, the magic is in the dirt.